A donkey was taken to the vet after he was attacked yesterday in Northeast Bend. His owner believes a dog at the adjacent off-leash dog park is responsible. Carly Keenan has the story. Good boy, Pancho. Behind me is where Big Sky Park meets Kathy Jensen's property. She believes a dog came through the fence and attacked her donkey. Although she didn't witness the event, she thinks the owners were close by. Jensen came home Tuesday night and noticed something was wrong with her miniature donkey, Poncho. And they were kind of milling around and Poncho was sort of staying away from me a little bit. And I could see something fuzzy on his ears. And I said, hey guy, you know, you've been rolling in something? What happened to your ear? And then I walked around and saw it. And he was, I mean, he was just bleeding. And his whole, under his ear right here, is all the, the hair is gone. He's just totally stripped of, of skin. Jensen found paw prints, footprints, and locks of Poncho's hair at an opening in the fence. She believes this is where the attack occurred. Deschutes County Sheriff's deputies are investigating. Jensen says five years ago, her other donkey, Daisy, was attacked. As a result, Big Sky Park put up wire around the fence, but Jensen says only 50 feet of wire was put up, leaving 100 feet accessible. If there's any way we can find whose dog it is, I think the dog needs to be contained and quarantined and possibly put down. Poncho is at the vet for at least two more days receiving treatment for his wounds. Daisy is keeping him company. In Bend, Carly Keenan, News Channel 21.